Hey everybody, we are out here at the Fitzgerald Park. We're getting ready to do about 3.7 miles. Got my daughter Bethany with me again today. She's not too happy to be on camera, so we're gonna keep her off it for most of the time. Just checking in, I've been out here plenty of times before. I have never done the actual hiking trails because honestly, I didn't even know they had any. This is definitely a new experience for me. I'll see y'all later. All right, so we are literally five seconds into this trail <laughs> and we already went the wrong way. But hey, we're back on course now, I think. It is quite chilly out here. My face is already a little frozen. So I'm kind of curious to know what it's going to be like when uh, winter hiking actually begins because it's only the end of October. But hey, I'll keep you updated. Wow, already super confusing on this trail. No markers. Just paths splitting left and right, back and forward. So just explore, I guess. So we got a bridge that I'm crossing now. There's one over there. We got some stairs here. They're called switchbacks. Right now I get to huff and puff going up these stairs. It's not too bad. It'd be even worse if uh, there weren't actual steps, I think. And if I didn't have my trekking pole to help pull my ass up. Because I like getting close to the river. Let's see if I can get that. There we go. You're not coming down here? Nope. She won't come down here. I don't blame her. But get some pretty pictures of the river here. All right, so we got to do a little diversion here on the trail because hunting season, part of the trail is closed because it's private property. I don't know what we're walking through, but it's like, I don't know, it almost seems like there's supposed to be a river here. I don't think this is a trail, but whatever. We'll figure it out in the middle of the woods, climbing through rivers. Like I was telling Bethany, I'm a kid in a candy shop right now. Okay, so yeah, bad idea. Uh, that was pure mud. Um, yeah, we both sunk. I think I got, I got the brunt of it for sure. But uh, we're gonna backtrack. We're gonna go back to the bridge. And there's a little side trail that we can take that's actually a trail and is actually marked. We're gonna take that instead and basically just cut this section that we were trying to get through just cut that right off the loop all right so we are looks like back on trail uh we took a little shortcut because for two reasons one it's private property and they hunt for two we didn't want to get shot so i think those are good reasons and it was really muddy over there and it, all right so three reasons it was extremely muddy as well so we are back on the correct path here we're what did I say? We're, I think we just broke a mile. So this is taking a lot longer than I expected it to, but whatever. I don't care. It's freaking gorgeous out here. So it makes it all worth it. So we have literally only done 
a mile and a half. Um, I don't know. It's going really slow for some reason. But here we go. Another bridge. Let's see if we can get that. It's pretty awesome. Uh, for being a short trail so far, I'm really liking it out here. Absolutely beautiful. Of course, we got some steps that we're coming up to that we're going to have to go walking up. But what is all that? Looks like somebody decided to do like a pottery class out here. Oh, there's some ledges for you right there, Bethany. We're going to go look at some ledges here real quick. All right, so check this out. And that's just a little bit of them. That's awesome. Are you good? Yeah. Because those stairs got me out of breath. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. So we are now walking down the road. Uh, yeah, that loop was 1.65 miles. It was kind of disappointing. Um, I thought it was going to be a lot more than that. But it's got us going down like a straight way and then back. Uh, I think that's supposed to add like two miles onto the um, trail. We'll see. All right, everybody. Well, we are back at the car now. Yeah, we're just gonna call it a day on this one. A little disappointing. Um, yeah, it wasn't quite as long as what I would have hoped, but we did complete the loop. Um, it was like 1.8 miles. Yeah, it was just, it was pretty. And that was about it. There are other trails inside the loop that we could definitely explore, but just not feeling it today. At least we got outside, got some fresh, clean air, uh, enjoyed nature, and that's what is important. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you haven't already, definitely subscribe to my channel. This has been Matt, and I will see you next time we go outdoors. Stay, bring me up high.